Hello my family members, those who are asking me sir which resources should we use to practice, from where can we take preparation for cloud and network security questions. Let me assure you that including today's session I have discussed almost 70 to 80 cloud and network security question that was asked in previous year and this year as well. So if you prepare them well then you must get common questions among them. Link will be given in the description box. Kindly watch that and subscribe for such content, right? Okay, let's go for today's session. If a subnet mask is 255.255.255.192, how many usable IP addresses are available in the subnet? To calculate uh, this problem you have to change the format into binary format right so the binary format for this subnet is this right I have actually pre-written the format so the format is this you have to count how many zeros are there right actually 1 2 3 4 5 6 right so there are total six zeros and the total usable IP address formula is 2 to the power 6 2 to the power number of zeros minus 2 minus 2 why because there are two reserved IP address right that's why we have to subtract 2 so 2 to the power 6 means 64 and minus 2 means 62 right so the answer will be 62 total usable IP address are available in this subnet. So if you understood this question then give me the uh, total usable IP address for 255.255.254.254. Uh, please give me the answer in the comment section right if you understood or if you not understood then kindly let me know okay. So go, go to the next question that is. Which of the following is essential concept related to cloud? Reliability, productivity, abstraction or all of the mentioned? Actually, the answer will be abstraction, right? Cloud computing abstracts the details of system implementation from users and developers, right? Okay, the next question is Dash computing refers to applications and services that run on distributed network using uh, virtualized resources. So what will be the answer? It is actually cloud computing. This is the name itself uh, actually suit or fits the blank, right? Cloud computing refers to application and services that run on distributed network using virtualized, virtualized resources, right? Okay, the next question is dash has many of the characteristics of what is now being called cloud computing you can pause the video and give me the answer in the comment section right okay the answer will be internet right uh, the internet offers abstraction and runs using the same set of protocols and standards and uses the same application and operating system right so the answer will be internet the next question is point out the correct statement the use of the word cloud makes reference to the two essential concepts or cloud computing uh, abstract system by pooling and sharing resources or cloud computing is nothing more than the internet or all of the above among them the answer will be this cloud computing abstract system by pooling and sharing resources okay the next question is a quiz for you and this is very important but easy which of the following is the deployment model i have already covered this deployment model in the previous video if you did not watch i am requesting you to please watch that because i have already covered right so i don't want to explain this more so please answer this in the comment section right which of the following is a deployment model okay the next question is how many types of dimensions exist 
in cloud cube model this is very easy question right i don't want to answer right so that there are actually four types of four types of di uh, dimensions exist in cloud cube model right okay the next question is which of the following cloud concept is related to pooling and sharing of resources poly polymorphism abstraction virtualization or none okay the answer will be virtualization actually virtualization uh, is the process of running a virtual instance of a computer system in a layer abstracted from the actual hardware right and most commonly it refers to running multiple operating system on a computer system right simultaneously so the answer will be virtualization right okay the next question is how many types of security boundary boundary values exist in cloud cube model how many types of security boundary values security boundary values two right so the next question is dash dimension correspond to different states in the eight possible cloud forms we, what will be the answer without delay i am answering but uh, if you don't, don't know the eight possible cloud forms then let me tell you that the private public community and multi distributed edge clouds are available right this there are eight forms of cloud right so among them uh, so what are the what is the dimension that corresponds to two different states in the above there are no option there is no option suit this right actually the answer will be sourcing dimension will be the answer okay the next question is or the last question is yes, the last question is a hybrid cloud combines multiple cloud where those cloud retain their unique identities but are bound together as a unit this is also solved in a previous video then so i am requesting you to please give me the answer in the comment section if you can't solve then please watch the previous one right this is a quiz question for you right the link is in the description box of previous video please watch that right so i hope you have learned a little in this session and please give me your feedback how was this session and how much did you learn right so that i can be motivated right so thank you for today's session